Video surveillance alone can't stop somebody from cheating. We saw alleged examples of that in Bridgeport, but it can deter and detect. In Enfield. And there we are. And there we are. This is what election security looks like. There are cameras in this general vicinity, but this is actually just upping the game in quality. With some spare change in the town election budget, Enfield spent about $8,000 putting state-of-the-art cameras at each of their three absentee ballot drop boxes. The town of Enfield considers this money well spent. Ultimately, it's all about election security. These cameras installed at each of the town's three drop boxes. The picture so clear they can identify license plates, individual faces, and colors, all through artificial intelligence. All the uh, film is captured, stored in the cloud. So again, it's easily available, backed up. Compare that to the grainy, unusable picture from the cameras outside Bridgeport City Hall during the recent ballot fraud hearing. We watch current events, and as any municipality probably does, we run through the gamut of could that happen here. Enfield says the drop boxes have been popular. A few years ago, a handful of mail-in ballots sent through the Postal Service arrived after Election Day and had to be tossed out. There are people who were still a little hesitant about the United States Postal Service. Not only are these cameras able to tilt and zoom, but the video is easily searchable. We can do a search and find all people with red shirts. We can find all white pickup trucks. We can find anything with a license plate ending in 412 or whatever we wanted to do. So far, 574 registered voters in Enfield have applied for an absentee ballot for the upcoming election. As of October 6, their requested ballot was mailed. Voters can continue dropping them off until 8 p.m. Election Day, November 7th. If there is any inclination for people to use the absentee balloting process, we want them to know that civic engagement is important and their vote counts and their vote will be counted. And for municipal elections, turnout is notoriously low. Here in Enfield back in 2021, it was only about 30% voter turnout, but more than 1,000 of those votes were absentee ballots, 10 of which had to be thrown out for issues like not having a signature. Moral of the story, check those packets, read, follow the directions. Reporting in Enfield, Matt Karen, Fox 61, Connecticut's news station.